Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Mr G Does PE. Now so far in this series we've been looking at keeping active. We've been looking at different ways you can be active and the effect that those activities have on our heart rate. This final stage is really important. It's up to you to make a three stage circuit. Now this circuit is well, somewhat difficult but I think you'll be up to it. Circuit needs to have three stages, an upper body, a lower body and a whole body activity. And remember, each of these activities must get the heart rate going. Now, I haven't designed the circuit for today. That has been done by my friend, Nelson. Say hi, Nelson. What a guy. Nelson and I have been friends ever since I've been in isolation in the sports shed. And uh, he's a really nice guy. He can be a little bit annoying. He's always trying to prove how much better he is than me, but... I just sort of leave that alone. I don't get sucked into it. Anyway, it's Nelson's circuit. Let's go see what he's got in store for me. Come on. I got 15. Where your chest set? What's your bench press? Where, where your chest set? What's your bench press? Where, 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 where? where? Chest, drive, chest, chest. Drive. That's great, Nelson. Got any other tricks? Yeah, uh, nice jumping, Nelson. Two and a half minutes, Nelson. Pretty good. Glad you know some very important people, Nelson. You know what, Nelson? You are better than me. You're better at bench pressing, better at bouncing on a trampoline. You're even better than holding a plank. But you know what? That's okay. Because in the end, I'm a nice person and I don't mind that you're better than me at that. Thanks for the workout. I'm going to play some cleats. Coins, uh, you wouldn't be interested anyway. Oh, Nelson, get those back!
maybe he annoys me a little bit. <laughs>